to my channel in this week's video at Tokyo Long University and I spent quite a few productive study sessions at the library and I also talked about what helps me to build a routine so without further ado let's jump right into the video <laughs> having lunch. I finished today's study session and it is raining and pretty windy as you can tell. Hey guys, it's another day and I'm currently walking to the library. It is raining again, but I'm very looking forward to finishing a few tasks. So let's have a productive day together.
Hello everyone, today is a studying from home type of day but before I start studying I thought I would share with you how I get back into routine because I feel like this could be helpful so I thought why not share it? So one thing I ask myself is what is currently missing in my routine? How do I find that out? I ask myself what my goals are and then I remind myself okay I want to have a healthy lifestyle so I have to look at aspects that guarantee a happy and healthy lifestyle so let's say sleeping well is one aspect working out spending time with friends and family spending time by yourself doing the things that you have to do such as if you're a student your exercises your exams prepare for them you know all of this stuff and one thing i've recently picked up again is working out for some reason i stopped working out i used to work out very consistently i am very happy to be able to pick up working out again how do i do that i have a yoga mat and a workout set and i turn on a pilates workout routine for 15 minutes and i do my workout like i don't i'm not going anywhere like i do this from my room literally so um it doesn't have to be fancy you know if you want to do something just work with the things you have at hand now the thing is okay working out once or twice is good but how do i help myself accountable well what i do for that is i take off my journal as you know i'm always talking about journaling but um, I take off my journal and I, I created like a habit tracker. I write down every single date of the day I want to work out. Let's say I want to work out four times a week. Then I pick four days of this week and I write down the date. And one thing that is very important is when you have a habit tracker in your journal, keep your journal where you can see it. Because I used to put my journal in a drawer and I would forget about it literally i would one day clean up my stuff and i'll be like oh i do have a journal and then i open it to see just what i wrote down and the last thing i wrote down was this habit tracker that i missed completely you know so make sure to keep your journal where you can see it every single day so that you get reminded of that habit tracker and just do it because after a few days you will eventually create a habit and that will make you happier in the long run because it does support your overall goals. So I hope this was helpful. Tomorrow is my last full day before the exam and I am so looking forward to taking it and get it over with. I've studied so much. I'm so tired. I'm going to get bed ready and then we shall see each other tomorrow at the library.
taking the exam. It was easier than I thought and I'm so very relieved I did it. So now it's time to relax. That's it for this week's video. I hope you enjoyed watching and I'm very happy to see you next time again. And until then, bye bye!